everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing my Autumn Bath and Body Works haul, and I'm so excited about this because I'm really embracing fall. I love fall, I love the fall season. And I grew up in Houston, Texas, where I was definitely a summer girl. I loved laying out in the sun, outdoor sports, and of course every kid growing up loves the summertime because there's no school. But as I've gotten older, I've definitely grown to like embrace the seasons more, and I now live in Utah where we actually have seasons, and the leaves change, and all the mountains will be like so beautiful and filled with color so I've definitely learned to embrace fall and embrace the seasons a little bit more as I've gotten older and fall definitely has a special place in my heart I love my leather jackets and my boots and my sweaters and I definitely love fall fragrances fall scents and fall candles are my absolute favorite so I'm very excited to share all the ones that I picked up for you guys for this season and I apologize that we don't have smell-o-vision I wish you guys could smell these scents with me so hopefully this video is not too boring since I'm just showing you guys how good they all smell but let me know down in the comments below if you guys enjoy Bath & Body Works hauls or if you guys are more interested in like the beauty side of my channel I would love to hear your thoughts so let's start off with wallflowers. I've only been buying wallflowers for maybe like a year and I absolutely love them. The only downside for me is they burn out so fast. You can't adjust the wallflowers, like the settings. So if you want to turn them off when you're not home, you have to turn them, you have to unplug them or you can't adjust like the amount of heat that goes into them. So they're constantly burning quite a bit of fragrance and they work very, very well. The scent definitely fills the room. It smells amazing the entire time that they're going but I just don't feel like they last very long. So I've kind of adjusted to using more of uh, candle melts, like the wax melters and scentsies and things like that, just because those are a little more cost effective and they last longer. But something about wallflowers is just so homey to me and I will probably continue to purchase them for quite a while. So the scents that I like to get in wallflowers are the ones that I want my home to smell like. The very homey, very rich, um, very warm, yummy scents. So one of my all-time favorites is the Marshmallow Fireside. Oh, this is delicious. It has this like very like rich uh, burn smell to it, but it still has this like very uh, manly sophistication to it with a touch of sweetness with the marshmallow. It's to die for. Marshmallow Fireside is one of my all-time favorite scents. I've been buying it for years and I'm obsessed. Um, also one that I really like is the Mahogany Teakwood. I've been buying Mahogany Teakwood for years along with every other girl on the planet. I can't run out of Mahogany Teakwood. I've got it in like 10 candle backups. Not exaggerating, I have probably 10. And I love having this one burning just in my living room. I think that's a great, uh, just like living scent. It's a very manly cologne kind of fragrance, but it just smells very homey to me. Another one of my favorites, this one's more my favorite from like fall into winter, not necessarily like the beginning of fall like we're at right now, but this is flannel. This one's super cozy. It just smells, again, it's one of those manly, like more sophisticated smells. I really like those kind of scents. But this one is a little bit more rich. So that's why to me it's more winter appropriate because it's a little warmer. It's a little bit more comforting. And then these two are like my favorites. <laughs> these ones aren't really like my husband's favorite scents. He likes the more like cozy, more uh, masculine fragrances. Not that these ones are feminine, but they're much sweeter. And this is the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, which is my favorite. I love this one. It's so sweet. It's so delicious. It makes you want to stuff your face with pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. And it's just so delicious. It smells like it has like a a richness of coffee because it has that like latte scent to it but it's mostly that like really heavy really sweet marshmallow pumpkin scent I would say it smells more of marshmallow than it does pumpkin but you still get that like autumn taste of pumpkin and it's so good if you guys like really sweet really rich fragrances marshmallow pumpkin latte will be your best friend and then the other one that I love is the Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. I really like the pumpkin um, sweet ones. Those ones are like my favorite. They make me feel so like homey, so fall time. They make me just feel good when I walk in the room. Like when I get home from work or when I wake up in the morning, I'm just like, yes, embrace the fall season. I am home and it smells delicious. <laughs> this one's a little sweeter than I would say the pumpkin, uh, the marshmallow pumpkin latte is, which is why I like the marshmallow pumpkin latte because it's still sweet, but it has that like almost like bitter coffee scent to it that to me is just perfect. 
So of course, since I love those two scents so much, I got the Marshmallow Fireside in the candle and then the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte in the candle as well. And I think that the candles almost smell more sweet to me. I don't know if that's in my head, but to me, the candles have more of like a sweetness to them, whereas the wallflowers tend to be a little bit more musky. Maybe because those are more like home fragrances, whereas the candles are more like, uh, they have like a an essence around them. They're going to give you more of a like cozier kind of experience than the wallflowers are going to. There's just this feeling that you get from a actual candle that's like lit and you get that flame and you feel that like coziness that you don't get from a wallflower. But I love that the wallflower just keeps that fragrance in your home all the time. So Marshmallow Fireside, definitely had to get that in the candle. And then the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. I have to have this in every form ever. It's so yummy. It's so sweet. It's so delicious. And I really wish that Bath and Body Works would start like making food that went along with their fragrances. <laughs> like if you could buy the like marshmallow pumpkin latte while you're at Bath and Body Works buying their fragrances, can you imagine just like how amazing life would be? I can't. And this is the vanilla pumpkin marshmallow which is very similar to the pumpkin marshmallow latte. <laughs> I hope I'm not confusing you guys with the names, but the vanilla pumpkin marshmallow doesn't have that like coffee scent. So if you guys don't like coffee or you don't like that more like rich, bold, uh, like undertone that those uh, coffee fragrances have, then try this one because this one's still very sweet and still delicious. But I know a lot of people don't like the smell of coffee, especially if it's not like morning time. A lot of people like connect to that with like their morning coffee. This one's really sweet and really delicious. Now my sweet husband is so much more mature than I am and he will get up super early before work and he will make his fresh morning cup of coffee and he will soak in the day, read the news, prep himself before he gets ready and goes to work. And during that time he likes to have a like good morning candle <laughs> and I'm so not that person. I will sleep in as late as I possibly can and I'm just not nearly as sophisticated as he is. But this is a candle that I got for him for his morning candle and this is crisp morning air this one is such a good fall fragrance a lot of these scents I feel like they're they're more wintry or they're fall into winter this one's definitely a like crisp fall morning this is perfect for right now this scent is very September October to me it just smells very clean very masculine but it smells like you're like fresh up in the mountains. I know not all of y'all have mountains around you, but my family has a cabin in Utah and we go up in the mountains, uh, usually in like the fall time, but we go year round. And in the fall time, right as the colors are changing in the leaves, it's just like so beautiful and you feel, feel so like fresh and you feel like you're in the like wild, but it's just like this perfect fall time. And that is what this candle reminds me of. It's just like my cabin in the morning. So I love this one. And this is gonna be perfect for his Good morning candle. <laughs> so I got the flannel candle and like I said, I like the flannel wallflower more for like fall into winter, but I think the candle is really nice for a cozy night in. I think that this one's a better like a daytime winter scent to me personally, but it is like very cozy and delicious smelling. I like this one more for like midday, like you're having a like winter day in and you just need it to be like a little more cozy in the house, but not like gonna put you to sleep cause you're watching a movie. Whereas like Marshmallow Fireside is more of my like date night watching Netflix, like just having a nice warm cup of uh, hot chocolate while cuddling up with your man. And then Mahogany Apple is another one of those like mid fall day. So while I would have like my flannel during the winter day, this is like fall day. So like today in the middle of the day, this is what I would have burning like behind me in my videos. And I love this one because it's more fresh. You get that like crisp apple scent to it. It's like got this freshness, but it's still like fall time. Kind of like the crisp morning air because it gives you that like very fresh kind of fall feeling that you like it's starting to get cold outside and you're starting to need a little bit of a sweater but you're not like needing that like rich boldness of like warming up it's more like lighter and I really like that <laughs> So I got my cozy, sophisticated scents for my husband. I, of course, have to get my, like, overly sweet, fun scents for me. And this is the Cinnamon Sugar Donut. This has been around for several years. This is a really good one. 
I really like this one. It definitely makes you want to eat cookies and dessert and stuff your face with mom's perfect fall treats. But I like it. I like that like cinnamon taste that it has because I don't like like cinnamon candles. I don't like those like really heavy, very like spicy scents. Anything too spicy is like super not up my alley. To me, it's just too harsh and too mature. So I like that this has that like sugary, very sweet take on the cinnamon because I think it's just like a perfect treat. And then this one is Caramel Pumpkin Swirl, which again is going to be that very sweet pumpkin scent. Oh, I love that this one has a very strong pumpkin to it though. Some of the pumpkin ones, I feel like they either smell too spicy and too pumpkin-y or they don't have enough pumpkin, like they're just sweetness. And I like that this has the sweet and the pumpkin. So caramel pumpkin swirl. Mm, it's just like a caramely sweet pumpkin. It's everything you could ask for. <laughs> My Bath and Body Works had these gorgeous candles. I love these ones. They're like they're traditional fragrances, but they're in different. They're from White Barn, but they're different than these ones. So I really got excited when I saw these because I thought they were so lovely and I really like to repurpose my jars after I finish my candles. So I'm very excited to use this up and use this for like decoration. But I also think that the candle just looks so gorgeous. I think this will look really pretty on my coffee table while it's lit. And this is Bergamot Waters. This one's a lot more fresh than the other ones. I have a feeling like this is like a spring one. I don't know if this was technically a fall scent, but I really like this one for the daytime. It's a good like cleaning the house fragrance. It smells very light, it's very fresh. It's not too like one seasoned, like it doesn't smell super summer, super spring, or really fall to me, but it just smells clean. And smells very fresh. It has that very like aqua smell to it, which I really like when I'm in the mood for it. And then this one, I've never seen this scent before. I don't know if this is new, I don't know if it's old, but this is Spiced Vanilla Marshmallow. And you guys have probably noticed by now, I love marshmallow. <laughs> I love marshmallow to eat and I love it to smell. And this one is delicious. It has this like sophisticated like spice to it that normally I don't like because I don't like things that are too spicy, but it's got that marshmallow to make it like extra sweet with the vanilla. Oh, it's so good. It's really, really nice. It's definitely fall time to me. It's not going to be a winter candle, but I really like it. It's sweet and it's spicy. It's like everything I could want in like the perfect fall scent in a beautiful little jar. It's definitely not going to take the place of my uh, marshmallow pumpkin latte. Nothing, nothing will ever take the place of that. But I really like this. And then as I said earlier, I have backups among backups of my mahogany teakwood. I honestly have like a jar of that in every single room, but I also have a bunch of backups of leaves. So this is an old leaves from last year, but I thought I'd mention it to y'all. Leaves is not my favorite. Leaves is not my kind of scent. It's a little more spicy than I like to go with. It is um, a light color capture and fragrance with nectar, apple, and spiced berries. So those kind of like fruity, spicy scents are not my personal favorite. I don't like the way this smells directly out of the jar. Like I smell it out of here and to me it smells like Hobby Lobby and I don't enjoy that. <laughs> I like something sweeter. I want to smell like a bakery, not Hobby Lobby. But when this one's lit, it's a little bit more toned down and I usually have this one lit with like other scents. So it's kind of like a like partner fragrance and my husband really likes this one. So we burn it when we have company over and stuff like that. But I wouldn't light this when I was by myself because it's not sweet enough or rich enough for me. So now that you guys have gotten an idea of what kind of scents I like, I like very like sweet indulgent fragrances, I'm sure you can guess what kind of body products I wanted to get. Ta-da! <laughs> this is the Pumpkin Cupcake Lotion. I love these 24 hour moisture, the Ultra Shea Butter Creams. These are so nice. I have gotten these for the last like year several times. These are like a body butter. I wish they were, I wish they did like a body butter, like a little thicker because I'm so dry and I really like to like lather up my skin. But this one is to die for. Ugh, pumpkin cupcake is so sweet. It smells uh, very feminine, but it has that like pumpkin scent to it. I really, really like this one. It smells really good, and the scent on these do linger. I can smell them on my body throughout the day, which I really appreciate. I wouldn't put this on for like a date night or anything like that. This is more just day to day when I want my body to feel good and I want to smell like cozy and I want to feel that like fall energy that I'm looking for. So. 
So I picked up three of my pumpkin cupcakes and then I picked up three of marshmallow pumpkin latte, which is just the best. I think that the body cream smells just as good as the candle. Maybe a little more sweet in the body butter version, um, which I like because I like to smell a little more sweet and a lot of my fragrances will complement that better, like the perfumes that I wear. Oh, it smells so good. And this one's awesome because I feel like these are just super hydrating. Like they feel uh, very luxurious on the skin. I feel like I can tell that my body's moisturized with these for like a longer period of time. And I bought these for buy three, get three free. So that's why I have three of these and three of these because it was a deal and these will last me all season. <laughs> I'm just like a marshmallow pumpkin latte freak. Like I really just... I just want to drink and eat and live in these fragrances. So I am all stocked up for the fall season. I've got all my fall candles, wallflowers, and body creams, and I'm so excited about it. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what kind of fragrances that I like for the fall season. And I do want to tell you guys, don't buy Bath & Body Works full price. I think it's worth it for sure. They have the best candles around. I think that their candles burn very, very well. The scent lasts a long time in the room, and I do feel like you get what you pay for when it comes to candles. But these are regularly, $22.50, you can get them on sale. You can get coupons. Sign up for their emails. Hold on to their bounce back cards. You can always get a great deal. Like I said, I got these for buy three, get three free, which is a much better price than just like buying them individually. And the wallflowers, I got like six for $24. And the candles, when I bought them, were actually on sale for $12. And then I used a 20% off coupon. And they always do like $10 off of $30 coupons. So definitely, definitely hold on to your coupons keep track of those um they will do sales you can get a good deal on these and stock up for the season like i do and we can just be candle and fragrance lovers together <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this video. It was a little different for my channel. I've never really talked about fragrance this in depth with y'all before, but I really enjoyed it and I'm so excited for fall. I'm getting like so bubbly and tingly just thinking about the fall season starting up and I hope y'all are excited too. So let me know in the comments down below what your favorite fragrances are from Bath & Body Works or other candle places. I just... I've tried other candles and Bath & Body Works is always the best in my opinion, but if y'all have other recommendations, I would love to hear them. And let me know if y'all enjoy seeing my Bath & Body Works or candle hauls because I will definitely continue to make them if y'all enjoy them, but I can stick to beauty if y'all prefer that as well. So thanks so much for watching and I will see y'all later. Mwah.